Welcome to your new home, Wonder Bundle members. I'm so excited to show you around. <laughs> let's just emphasize my dramatic cat jumping off of a counter. All right, so let's get started. First things first, I'm not even logged in yet. I'm gonna start at the very, very beginning so that you know exactly what to do. So first we are gonna go over and open up a brand new browser. So whatever device you're on, doesn't matter, iPad or your phone, um, you're gonna go to uh, open up your favorite browser. So like Chrome, Safari, Internet Explorer, Firefox, those are all popular choices. And you're gonna open up a new tab and right in the top, um, awesomeartschool.com for starters. And then our uh, computers or devices should look about the same if you're not logged in yet. So you know you're not logged in if it says login up here at the top. So go ahead and click that. You have an account because you, um, you're, made your enrollment. So this is actually not the right one I want. So here is my email. So put, you're going to type in your email and your password. Um, oh, by the way, let me go back for a second. If for some reason you forget your password, and I highly recommend writing it down in a safe place so you don't have to run into this. It's so annoying. Um, first of all, you can click this little remember me. Um, that is helpful. And if you have like a password saver in your device, that's also helpful. Um, if you do forget your password, don't panic just click right here where it says forget password. They should make it a button. It's just the words. But if you click on it, it'll lead you through some prompts so that you can reset it and just follow them. And you'll wind up back here with your email and your new password. And then once you have that set, you're going to go ahead and click the purple login button. This is super normal. Uh, and this is a safety feature that your devices have so no one can hack into your account. So when you get this, I, I just got a notification on my phone that I got an email because there was a login attempt on my device. So I'm going to go open that email and I'm going to type in this six character code that's numbers and letters. Just for my safety, I'm just going to pause for this part so you don't see it, little sneakers. And then after I enter my code in, I'm going to click next. Okay, so right after I clicked next, it brought me back to the home, the home screen. All right, so this is the exciting part. First, I need to switch the view on my screen. I'm an admin, so mine has a couple extra features. Um, okay, so um, here's, here's my hottest tip for you. There's only really three, four places you need to worry about, four buttons you need to worry about at this point. You are going to think of the club as um, three individual clubs because that's really what it is. So when you're going to wake up in the morning and you are going to say, hey, what do I want to work on today? Do I want to do a drawing? If so, you're going to head to the Fun Fab Drawing Club. Or do I want to paint? If so, you're going to head to the Mixed Media Society. Or am I in the mood for something magical? That would be the Celtic Collective. And these buttons at the top are the quickest and easiest best way to get to see all the projects in all the places. Now, those are, so that's three. I said, remember I said there's four places that you should know. So three places are these buttons at the top and they're always there. So it's really hard to forget. And they're there if you're logged in or not. So just make sure you're logged in. That's what we just went over, okay? And the other place I want you to know is this where it says the Wonder Bundle Classroom right here. Now, if you scroll down, you actually have access to all of these as well. And you can go into things that way, but I find that very confusing. I like to use what these called the visual indexes because that's where you can actually see all the lessons. So that's at the buttons at the top that I was just saying, and we'll get there in one second. But first I wanna talk to you about the fourth place you need to be able to go and here is why. And what we're gonna go to is right here where it says the Wonder Bundle, okay? So we're gonna click, so it's a 79 course bundle, no joke. And this is why we're gonna go pick up our helpful pages first, because these are what's gonna keep us organized, okay? Okay, so follow me. We're gonna go into that Wonder Bundle classroom. There's not much in here, but everything in here you should know about, because these are all tools to help you. Let me make my head, my giant head smaller. 
Okay, so here's our welcome tour. That's what you're watching right now. So if you're ever like, oh God, I need that tour again, just remember, just go straight to your big Wonder Bundle classroom to get reacquainted anytime. This is also where you download your guide. You're gonna want that as well. That's very, very helpful. I'm gonna show you right now how to download it. Okay, it has all of this information in it. It's all technical, it's all membership stuff. It's how to do everything I'm kind of showing you right now, but in a book form. You can buy a copy on Amazon right here if you want. You do not have to because I'm also, I'm giving it to you right here. So don't feel like you have to. If you wanna download this to your device and you also don't have to download it, you can keep it right here, right where it is. It's already saved here for you. So you don't clog up your device. You can click the purple paper clip and that will download it. And then you can print it out if you would like. But again, you don't have to do that because it's right here. And you can also purchase, I need books. I can't do the virtual thing. So I, that's why I have it in book form for you as well. So it's good to know that that's where the guide is. Also, I'll change views a little bit. It's a little bit crowded this way. Just went back one screen. Um, you also have the workbooks that come with your membership. Okay, and again, there are a lot. The Mixed Media Society workbook is 300, 260 pages. Um, so if you would rather grab the uh, paperback copy, you can do so if you would like. Um, and annual members, as I'm sure you know, get the guide, the two workbooks and the Celtic Collection reference book mailed to them. But everyone is, you all have them right here for you to download, look out. You can also download and print out just specific pages. You don't even have to print out like every page. You could just grab single pages. That's a, that's an option too. So you don't feel like you have to do any of the things you don't want to do. But the, um, this is very handy. This is right here as we're on this navigation notes. So all of these pages, so I just want to show these to you. So you have navigation notes and these only, only Wonder Bundle member people get these. You have pretty planner pages also designed for you for all of the clubs. And what a lot of people like to do um, is print these ones out. These ones are really made for printing. Again, if you don't want, they're all about 30 pages each. You don't have to print all of them out. There might be some that you're just not interested in, but let's go look at some of these. I just wanted to give you a rundown on what's here. So we have your navigation notes and these show you these are like quick little ways that show you how to get around. They're kind of like cheat sheets. They like tell you how to get around and then you can make a note of how that works so you can do it again. <laughs> There's also, I have all sorts of extra little resources just for you guys because I know organization is really important. And you also have um, a daily plan sheet, which helps you kind of like pick out where you're in the mood for. So here is what the... Um, these are what the navigation notes look like. So you can print this out. So say you're in the mood for the drawing club. So you can um, grab this sheet for the day. You can write the classroom name. You can write the lesson name. And then you can make note, how did I get here? So the way one is how I'm showing you in this video today. Way two is the way that I said I didn't like because you scroll and you can't see anything. And then there is another way as well, which is just typing in this link right here. But um, you still have to be logged in, which is why I always like number one. That's why I put it as number one. But there are, I do know people try different ways. And there's one of these for each club. And the little, the little doodles and the colors changed again to help keep you organized. So you can download those. And again, you just click the purple paper clip here. I'll do it right now so you can see exactly. And every device is going to look a little bit different. <clears throat> Excuse me. So right up here on the top, I can click my print icon and those can print out. So you can print out a, one of those for each day or every day that you do like a new lesson. So I'm just clicking tabs up here at the top to go back to where I was, but it's just as, as easy as clicking that little, that little a button. Okay, then we have um, we have the pretty planner pages. So this is a packet. Um, uh, it's a PDF. It's uh, twenty-eight to thirty pages for each club, and I will show you. 
<clears throat> if you put your cursor over the cover and scroll down, you can, um, these are so humongous. There we go. You can just see all of these. So you might not want all of these, but they're super colorful and fun. They kind of get you in the mood. So this is the one for drawing club. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we have drawing day notes. I love this packet so much. So you can jot down the day's date, your lesson name, classroom name, what I love in my drawing, what I'd like to improve, what I learned. So this just helps you focus a little bit and keep track of like all of these things because there's a lot to digest in when you have the Wonder Bundle. So, um, so it's really nice to have a little bit of a worksheet to help that, that you can have by you at your side while you're creating. This one obviously is just a fun supplies, like things I need. And there's fun little quotes on here. It's really like a um, specific journal. It's really, these are really nice. You have the, I, there's, those are the things you need. And then here's a separate list for things I want. Cause you know, sometimes those are not the same thing. Um, and then these are kind of your goals, 10 things I'm excited about this year how I want to grow. So you can just take a moment. There's a lot of, we actually made this packet based on a two hour Zoom that I had with um, my magical team member, Mandy Brown, who designed all of these pages. We actually had a two hour Zoom meeting with our Wonder Bundle members and they told us what they wanted, uh, what their struggles were. All these Wonder Bundle members were overwhelmed and they wanted to keep track and they wanted to set goals. Um, and then we put a really extra playful spin on it by creating all of these. So this is this is based directly on actual member feedback and really nothing else. So we really hope those that members that are new kind of know where those came from. They came from other yous who have come here before. They're really cool. So these are um, also, we know there's a big mental component of doing art and getting creative a lot of time, which I don't spend a lot of time talking about, but I'm very aware that it's a very big deal for all of us. So there's some pages in here that will touch on this a little bit and kind of help you get reflective, um, help set priorities. And again, like if you're not into that, like just disregard those pages and don't print them. But if you really need that and want it, we hope that you enjoy them and get some get some use out of these. This is where I'm kind of right now. This is what I need to be focusing on. Terrible. So here's a monthly self-care tracker. And then you have some monthly drawing goals. You can jot those there in well as well. I don't even know what I just said. Um, how to achieve my monthly goals. So there's some daily, weekly, and monthly goals in different spots. You can check things off to really help you keep track. We have our weekly drawing. We have sort of mini goals for that week. I love this. Laughter on me this week. This was me today. Oh, I have a funny, I can't to share that story on the line, but I do have a very funny story. If we were in a Zoom call right now, I would tell you. Um, so this is super fun. Uh, drawing days. So this would be like the today. <clears throat> this is what I would like to do tomorrow. That's what I do actually every day. I, I write a list. Here's my list for today on this uh, ugly yellow pad and see all my things that are crossed off and some things that are not. And then before I go to bed tonight, I flip a new page and I write what I want to start tomorrow. So that's what these sheets that are way prettier can do for you. So that's tomorrow's plan. And then we have our uh, weeks and reflection. What went, what went well, what didn't go well. There's our drawing tracker. So there's a tracker for your drawing goals, but there's also a tra uh, tracker for your kind of self-care goals. I love this one so much, websites that inspire me because you know how many times you're on Pinterest and you find something and you're like, oh, I got to write that down. This happens to me all the time. And then I can never find it. <laughs> I'm like, where was that? Who was that? So you have a place to, to jot that down. There's a reflective sheet about technology, some nice reminders in there. Um, this is a very important page for people who get caught up with negative self thoughts. You can put those out on paper is very helpful. I love this because I'm such a I'm such a music crazy person. So this is, talks about your relationship with music, how uh, how you can jot down some notes, and then again, there's some words that won't define me, and then how you rise above. 
art books in me. You guys know I'm obsessed with making them and buying them. So this is a great one again to like go if you're on Amazon and you're searching through or you grab one or you're at the bookstore, you can make help take notes so you can remember where you got things. And this is I'm such an avid reader. And so this is a great thing, a great place to be able to take notes there as well. So there's one of these packets and they're all slightly different color schemes so you can help keep track they're all kind of opposites and different they have a different look to them a little bit so that's what those are so i'm really excited about this one this one's a little bit longer it's 31 pages um and you can see the color this is much celtic more celtic -y. <laughs> So yeah, we really hope that you enjoy using those and they really make use of them to help you in your journey as you um, go through the Wonder Bundle. And then this is um, three more sheets that like if you just want like a quick one off for the day, you can go here. These are just three extra pages. Um, so here are the first one you can, it's like your club and daily lesson plan. This is again, just for Wonder Bundle members. So you can write down like, well, okay. Like, this is what I would do. I would be like, okay, what's the date? You circle the day. I'm in the mood for what am I in the mood for? And then you can pick your mood and then the club that you're going to go work in, circle that. And then you can write the classroom name and then write the lesson and then taught by because Lucy teaches, Bryn teaches. Um, and then this one is someone wanted that a couple people expressed um, concern and, and interest in tracking their videos because some lessons have 10 videos, some lessons have two. And so this way they could like keep track of how many videos they watched of a lesson. Because what I didn't realize is that like people, um, you know, like say you had, you had to stop and go get a grandkid from school that day and you didn't finish and so this way you can um before you start like quick take a quick note of how many videos there are before you start and then you can keep track of them as you watch so you know how many you have left in case you got interrupted okay and then here is an actual page on that called oops didn't finish and then you can quick remember that too and so the next day you're not like oh crap so you can quick print this out and be like, oh, that's right. The day was yesterday. That was the day I left. Um, if you resumed or not, the club you're working in again, and then make a note of why you had, didn't finish. That way it just, all of these extra sheets just help you stay organized on track and just less scatterbrained. So you know exactly what's going on at all times. You can just keep track kind of in pen and paper form of where you are, where you're going and what you're doing and how much you're improving. How cool is that? So you can thank all the past members who have helped shape uh, the evol and, and form the evolution of those forms as they appear today. Okay. So, oh, before I go, also this big this we call this the parent classroom because it holds like everything else um but this is also where office hours are so we actually didn't have dedicated wonder bundle office hours until very recently as you can see depending on when you're watching this video but remember because you are a fully enrolled member of all the clubs you also you get have um you guys have a zoom with me every single week because you do a zoom for drawing club a zoom with me for mixed media society a zoom with me and lucy for celtic collective and then also the zoom for just the wonder bundle members because you guys have concerns that are different than the people that are in just in one club so how's that so you guys have every single week every tuesday uh that's the day it might change, but that's what it is as at the date of this recording. Um, okay, so let's, that's what's all in this. This is all those helpful things are in this Wonder Bundle, the classroom that says actually Wonder Bundle on it. So let's go back to the actual clubs now. So when you're cruising around, I want you to think of these as separate clubs, even though I know you have them all. I just think it will help your brain stay organized. And remember, you always click to these buttons on the top. And the good news is that if you are a beginner, there is a place for you all to start at the beginning in all three clubs. So um, hopefully that means without going into it too much, if you are advanced already, and a lot of our members are, you can go wherever you like. So you can just come in here. I click the button. Okay, you'll see. Our lovely calendar of events is right on here for you. Here is a quick one click of a button 
that goes right to the book and you can go and download your free books that come with your membership. This is where the office hours are. These are where the office hours live for just the drawing club, which you can go to. And this is where your free cheat sheet library goes, goes to. And this is where just the drawing club latest lessons are. So this is always what the lessons were for just a drawing club this month and last month. And that's it. If you're new, you can watch this video. This video comes down someday. It's okay. Cause I'm going to always leave this up. This just tells the beginners where to go. This is just a visual of all of these beginner classrooms that you can go in a row. Now, if you're like, mm, I'm not a baby beginner, but I'm definitely not advanced. You can read these levels and these are all nice and easy to read in your workbook and the guide that you guys get with your membership too. It's a little hard to read them on the website because the resolution is not high, but all of this information is also in your guide and, and your workbooks for all clubs. Okay. So it's kind of repeated over and over again. Across all three clubs, button colors mean the same thing. So even though Celtic Collective has cool little Celtic knots in them, the pink ones still mean easy. The blue ones, teal, still mean medium. And the purple still means advanced. That's the same throughout all three clubs. So you just keep your eyes peeled for the color that best describes you and where you are at. And that's what you can aim for. And again, if you're an advanced, just you can go wherever you want. You can, anyone can always go wherever they want. You do not have to do anything order in order if you don't want to. I think it's just nice if you're a super beginner to know that there is a curriculum in place for you to follow. And you just simply start at the, you start at supplies, stage zero, and you go stage one, stage two, stage three. Okay. And when you click the button, now, um, I'm redoing the visual indexes at the time of this recording, so they might look a little bit different. And the drawing club, you have to click here, and then you click again. And these are the high res ones. Now, if you're not a paying member, when you, I just clicked that button, this doesn't work. This will say like for like, nope, you're not, you're locked out. So this is only for members. Now, these are the actual buttons that take you to the actual lesson. Okay. Does that make sense? Okay. So all my tabs are open. I can't even remember which one I was on. Click your tabs at the top to get back to where you were. <laughs> okay. So we're going to follow in line and these go in order. Okay. Now, when you go through zero through seven, when you graduate from each layer, if you're going in order, you can with confidence go out into the rest of the drawing club and do whatever you want and have complete success like easy, medium, hard. Obviously some things will be harder than others, but yeah, you can just go and binge and explore all these different lessons. There's hands. Hopefully you know kind of what's available. Figures. I love that drawing. I love that classroom. This is the fantasy classroom. So we have all these themes. Here's a classroom on toned paper. A classroom just for the dudes. You can jump in to do the 100 Fun Fab Faces Challenge. That's a great thing that anyone can do. A lot of progress gets made when you do those challenges. Here's my Fun Fab Furry Friends classroom. If this is a great one, if you're creatively stuck and you're mm, not feeling so great, this is a great one to dive into because it's just super fun. But there's also some serious ones in there too. So it's not all kind of crazy. Here's a florals classroom. Fun Fab Facades is where you'll learn urban sketching. And I do have to say too, in the, um, in the workbooks, it will tell you at the beginning of each chapter for each classroom, if you need experience or if you should start at a different classroom first. So like for Fun Fab Facades classroom, it'll say, yes, do the mermaid stage seven classroom first, and then come over here and join us. That way you'll just have the best background for it. So look, use your, your workbook and your guide to help you find the right place for you. All the information you need is here. This is ridiculous Adam's family <laughs> series. I did one October, which was so fun. And then this drawing the decades has been a blast and this is ongoing. So there'll just be more lessons here showing up and new classrooms showing up here over time as well. All right. So that's the drawing club. So how do we get back? 
where were we? Every time you're lost or confused or like, oh, just go back to awesomeartschool.com. Just go back to the main homepage. Make sure you're logged in and get your bearings, okay? If you see this little head circle up here on the right, that means you are logged in. And actually, if you click it, this is where your settings are. You can cancel your subscription right here when you're done. You can change your credit card information. You can change your password. That's where you do all your that stuff too. I should have said that first. That's kind of important. So again, and then now let's go check out the Mixed Media Society. So that has its own button up here. So I'm going to click that. And that takes me to the visual index for the Mixed Media Society. All right. And again, the first thing that greets you is the calendar. And here, MMS is Mixed Media Society. So you can see that's your lessons for this club. FFDC stands for Fun Fab Drawing Club. And I think Celtic Collective is always spelled out. Here are all your cl your clubs, your books that come with the club, which you get access to there. Same thing, same order as the drawing club. You have your office hours, the YouTube uh, cheat sheet library. So all the cheat sheets, you never have to ask me for them on YouTube, you guys. You have them all right here. And those are your latest lessons. Karen's World is a rundown of all my, like the most frequently used supplies that I use like and buy and there's links there's a little like a little i just do like a little show and tell on each product just so you know what it is and why i like it and then because a lot of times people are like what is her favorite gesso and then you can go there and l learn in two seconds and then just like the drawing club if you are new if you're new to my world and mixed media you want to start here stage zero and work your way up if you've taken my hamburger course, um, you'll have a lot of experience. You can skip all, you can skip zero through eight and you can zoom on into all the other bonus classrooms of which there are like a million. Okay. But if you're new, start here. And if you need a refresher or some quick links to supplies, you can start back. You can always reference these beginner classrooms at any time. I get a lot of questions on brushes. And so like, there's a whole lesson here all on brushes. So like you might be, you know, in the club for two years and be like, oh, what? But if never tried watercolors and you decide to dive in one day and you're like, what is, what water, watercolor brushes does she use? Everything about brushes is right here for you. So you can just go back and reference that. So these are the beginner classrooms again, if you're new. So we have, this is, um, yeah, we're just talking about like, what, what can you art on? That's this classroom. The slicer is all about collage and what uh, good adhesives are. The painter is, if you're brand new to painting with acrylics, this is for you. Stage four is um, learning about permanent and water soluble supplies. And we do just do one project. I gotta add some more cause that's so fun. And then stage five is all about uh, gelatos, alternatives. And then I ha actually have a new project coming that's just using gelatos. This is just gelatos. This is gonna be gelatos over acrylics, which is how I use them in my hamburger system and in all my mixed media um, projects normally. And then we have a classroom on sealants because this comes up all the time. Liners, which is pit pens and finishers, which also comes up all the time. And then we bust into our uh, magic mark maker so if you took my hamburger course you can you can and you actually completed it you can cruise anywhere you want so you have the magic mark makers classroom which is all on like markers and color pencils and water soluble fun things and then you have the awesome acrylics classroom and the the classrooms that set up are set up by individual meeting actually are an entire curriculum and like standalone courses in and of themselves. I used to sell them individually and they also start at the beginning, which is why the buttons go from pink, blue to purple as you go up in difficulty. But there's some oldies but goodies in here. Um, there are lessons that are six years old and there's lessons in here that are six minutes old, but like art never goes out of style, right? Like all these techniques are kind of evergreen and they last and stay true forever. So I hope you enjoy all the old ones, medium old ones and the new ones, just the same. Um, yeah, so there's a whole range of styles and different projects in here. This is the watercolor module. If you're new to watercolors, it's a great place to get a good background. And the encaustics is my freaking favorite and nobody does it, which makes me mad. You guys should do it because it's so fun. And then mix, mixing the media is really is an introduction to art journaling. 
and more mixed media techniques. And then here's a whole classroom on fountain pen inks, which I'm obsessed with. And I have a new, I forgot, to, I haven't put my new um, lesson in there yet. This is a whole classroom for gouache. And see how it goes from pink to blue to purple because it's easy, medium, hard. This is just a fun, fun classroom filled with just Stabilo all drawings. This is a classroom for mixed media magic that they accompany all of my books. And then here's a whole classroom on the hamburger system. So all those starter classrooms that were the starter classrooms zero through eight, once you complete those, you can do any of these, all these hamburger lessons. There's like 30 or something. You can do them all. So fun. Now, Mixed Media Hot Dog is a mixed media project that has four or fewer layers, and there should be a way more projects in here, so there'll be more coming over time. I got you. There's one that has fantasy themes in it, and if these are cut off, oh, she's actually a, oh, what is she, like a six-foot mermaid, I think, in full size? So yeah, if the, any of these are cut off, you can kind of click. That, that unicorn's the cover of your workbook. There's a whole, um, there's a whole classroom of animals that you can enjoy. <laughs> and then there is a classroom for Art Deco, flowers. I did a tulip portrait series in 2021, I believe, which I love. It's adorning my hallways at home. Uh, pretty painted portraits. You know there's going to be more there. Uh, keep your eyes peeled for more lessons from Bryn. Wynn is do does likes to do teaching from time to time. She's awesome. And then you have a whole classroom for holiday work, and then more being added over time. So, whew, you guys ready for this? Now let's head over to the Celtic Collective. So we go back to the home page and click the button at the top. In the same format, you have the books included with the membership. Now, I don't have a calendar here because it's always the same. The seventh of the month is always when our new, uh, because it's a lucky, it's a lucky number. Seven is a magical number. So our lessons will always drop on the seventh. And then the Zoom cards are always on the 21st. So that's why there's no calendar because that does never changes. So here's your quick link to the, your latest lessons. Now you're, um, again, if you're brand new to watercolor or Lucy in my world, you can come here and this quill and parchment classroom is just all about supplies that we use. Our scribe notes are like our PDFs and supporting materials that we like. Our sacred stone circle, those are our monthly Zoom meetings. So you can get to the replays right there. And then here was that same, you see the button colors are exactly the same as the other button colors. They're just cooler because they have Celtic knots inside of them. So if you're new, just like in the other two clubs, you have a place where you can begin. So the maidens are people that they're kind of, we wanted to call it virgins, but we didn't know if that was like too, too much for people. <laughs> but basically if you have no experience, you can start here and get like super baby basics on watercolors, inks, alcohol markers, uh, toned paper. Yeah, and like super basics and then some very nice, easy lessons. And then you guys get to binge all of these super fun fantasy themed classrooms. So Unsealy Courts are like the bad fairies. Um, Sealy Court are the good ones. Uh, this is the magical potions of the ancient apothecary. Herbs, fungi, potions, flora, crystals, and more. Oh, I have a cat that is inserting herself literally in my, between my microphone. Are you serious right now? All right, I have to make this quick. She's going to bite me. She's she's in my face is 2 inches from the microphone and she's in between us. I have no words, Tippy. Oh my god. All right, we have many magnificent manses. Oh boy. We have uh gods and goddesses. We need way more of those projects, don't you think? Mythical creatures. Oh, I love the Celtic collective. <sighs> Masters of magic are spellcasters, so our witches and our witches are with witches. <gasps> witches and wizards live in there. We have sexy Celts and kilts. And then my favorite classroom, which is the Master's Apprentice. Oh, I love this one. So yeah, we've studied and you can just binge whatever you want. But we've looked at um, I forget who this first one was. That's so funny. That's a shame on us. I forget his name. Um, but we've studied um, 
quite a few artists, which is awesome. And last but not least, we have the Celtic Wheel of the Year. And we've only done three at the time of this recording. So pretending on when you're watching it, there might be like eight, all eight in there. So eventually there will be eight because there's eight in total. But that is all how to get to all the things. They all work the same. We find the lesson that you're interested in. You just click on it and away you go. Here's links. There's the picture. You always have your references. Oh, boobs. Oh, more boobs. And then the videos are below. You, If you have questions, you can put them right below the lesson. And if you click on this little icon, you can upload a picture of your projects. And if you have questions, um, you can drop them in there too, or leave them in the Facebook group. Um, and if you really need to hear from me specifically, you can also shoot me an email. It's always your best bet. Okay, so relax into your Wonder Bundle experience. I'm really afraid of my cat right now. And if you do have any questions, though, just please remember, do not flounder around. We have a whole, Jesus. We have a whole team literally of magical team members who are standing by who are just ready to help you so tara is here jeanette is around jeanette is in awesome art school in the classrooms every day answering questions margo checks my email like a million times a day so that i don't miss anything so always reach out i don't want anyone struggling and there's no dumb questions you can also ask questions in the weekly Zoom calls, but if you have questions about tech, like even if you can't log in, like literally there's no question too small, there's no dumb questions, please, please reach out so we can help you get unstuck as fast as possible, okay? Okay, what's my email? Karen at awesomeartschool.com, okay? We are here for you, and you only, and we just want you to have the time of your life and make amazing art, okay? Welcome. Now, if you're an annual member, don't forget to reply back and let me know your address so we can get your books out to you. Okay. All right, you guys, enjoy. Enjoy. If you have any questions, reach out.